don't think I look like a tourist at all. I don't know what you mean. It's just, you know. Okay, I totally look like a tourist. But I tell you what, I don't walk around like a tourist. I go from point A to point B directly without any problem because I have a 3G card in my phone and I got it at this little shop behind me here. I don't know if you can see it. It's called Cheers, which is it's like a little convenience store. Um, I imagine 7-Eleven, those kind of stores are similar. Um, it's really quite simple. Um, you have a couple of options. Um, I went with Singtel and there are other operators that you can use as well. I went with Singtel, it was the easiest, it was the quickest, so I just went with them. And this place is literally right next to my hotel, so I just went here. Basically the girl did everything for me. Um, you do need the passport. I gave her a passport and then you have different data plans. You have like a one day plan for two gigs, a three day plan, seven day plan, 14 gigs at 25 Sing dollars. So I went for the seven day plan, um, seven dollars, um, and that includes one gig of data per day. And the rest of the money on that card, it's a prepaid card, the rest of the money on that card you can use to make phone calls or whatever, or I guess you could buy more uh, data if you wanted to as well. So first you buy the SIM card at 15 Sing dollars, and then you call star 363, I think it was. Um, and that will connect to some um, automatic operator and they'll send you a couple of text messages after that where you have to select number one, number two, number three. I got to the first one which said, what do you want to do? Do you want to add data? Which I said yes and then they were asking some other questions. I got confused. I just gave it over to the girl at the store and, um, and she basically did everything for me. So check for existing prepaid data plan or subscribe. Subscribe, huh? It's important to know though when you put your SIM card into your phone you need to turn off all the data and everything and once everything is set up then you turn the data back on. So according to this I now have data for the seven days that I'll be in Singapore uh, which means I'll be able to access my Google Maps which is the single most important thing for me because I walk around a lot and I need to know how to get from point A to point B um, fast and efficient. So this is really going to make my life a lot easier. Um, I do have an extra $8 on that card. Um, I'm not sure, I could probably use that to make phone calls. Maybe I can use it to, to add more data if I needed it. I doubt that I'll go over a gig a day just for Google Maps and WhatsApp. Um, most of the hotels, coffee shops, restaurants have Wi-Fi as well. But if you do need to recharge, I think it's relatively easy. By the way, you can buy the SIM card at every department store, I guess, every convenience store, 7-Eleven. Um, there's another equivalent, this Cheers place. Um, and as I said, Lots of, lots of uh, companies you can go for. I happen to go for Singtel today. It was the easiest and it was just so convenient. It was right next to my hotel.